Hi, my name is Stuart J. Murphy. I'm the author of the Math Start series. Math Start contains a total of 63 books that teach mathematical concepts in the context of stories. Today I would like to read you a special book called Slugger's Car Wash. Slugger's Car Wash is all about washing cars. It's about baseball, but it's really about how to learn how to add dollars and cents. I hope you enjoyed the story. It's read with the permission of HarperCollins Children's Books. Slugger's Car Wash by Stuart J. Murphy Illustrated by Barney Salzberg The 21st Street Sluggers had a problem. They were going to be in the playoffs for the very first time. That wasn't the problem. In two weeks, they had to play the 7th Avenue Spitfires. That wasn't the problem either. Look at these t-shirts, said Julia. They're worn out, they're dirty, and they have holes the size of manhole covers. We've got to get some new t-shirts before the playoffs. That would cost a lot of money, said Lily, at least $100. Coach said if we raise some money, he could probably get all the parents to match it, Julia reminded them. Yeah, but how are we going to raise the money, CJ demanded. I know, said Will, a car wash. Hey, that's a great idea, said Lily. We can get the whole team to help. All right, said CJ. Let's get started right away. We'll charge $3.50 a car. Let's put all our money together. Then we can get out and buy supplies. All the team members emptied their pockets. CJ kept a record of who gave what amount of money. Fifteen one dollar bills equals fifteen dollars. Twenty quarters equal five dollars. Eighteen dimes equals one dollar and eighty cents. Twenty-four nickels equals one dollar and twenty cents. And eighty-nine pennies equals eighty-nine cents. Add it up, it comes to twenty-three dollars and eighty-nine cents. Then he sorted out the dollars and all the different coins. He made a decimal point between the dollars and the cents as he added everything up. We have $23.89, he announced. That's almost $25. Lily and Will, you guys go get soap and sponges, CJ directed. Julia, you can get some poster board for signs. What are you going to do, asked Julia, as CJ handed out money to the sluggers. I'm going to set up my office, said CJ. Before long, everyone was back from their errands. They gave CJ the change. Sponges, $8.13. Soap, $4.75. Poster board, $4.50. That comes to $17.38. CJ counted up the money they had left. While Will made a big sign, CJ got a chair and a beach umbrella. While Lily filled the buckets with water, CJ got himself a tall glass of lemonade. Two one-dollar bills equals two dollars. Seven quarters equals one dollar and seventy-five cents. Eight dimes equal eighty cents. Twenty-four nickels equals one dollar and twenty cents. And seventy-six pennies are seventy-six cents. Add them all up, it comes to six dollars and fifty-one cents. They didn't have to wait very long. Will's mom was their first customer. Julia was in charge of the hose. Will had the soap, Lily handed out the sponges, and the sluggers all started to wash. Soon, Will's mom drove her clean car over to the cash table. She handed CJ a $5 bill. Let's see. $3.50 plus two quarters makes $4, and a dollar bill makes $5, said CJ. He handed her $1.50. Tell your friends to come to the Slugger's car wash. Then he figured out how much money they had now. Keep working, guys, he shouted. We've got a long way to go. One $5 bill equals $5. One $1 bill equals $1. Five quarters equals $1.25. Eight dimes equals 80 cents. 24 nickels are $1.20. 76 pennies are 76 cents. Add them all up and it comes to $10.01. A red convertible was next. Will scrubbed, Lily polished, Julia squirted the hose. Oops, she said. 
the driver of the convertible handed CJ two one dollar bills, four quarters, four dimes, and two nickels. CJ counted. Hmm. Two one dollar bills plus four quarters makes three dollars, and four dimes is forty cents, plus two nickels makes fifty cents. That's three dollars and fifty cents. Exact change. We appreciate your business, CJ said with a bow. The sluggers washed a green pickup. Julia squirted, Lily polished, Will scrubbed, whoops, he said. CJ sipped his lemonade. The driver gave CJ a $10 bill. CJ counted, hmm, $3.50 plus two quarters makes $4, plus $1 makes $5, plus $5 makes $10. He gave her back $6 and two quarters. Next was a yellow station wagon. Will scrubbed, Julia squirted, Lily slipped. Yuck, she said. Hurry it up, guys, said CJ. There's a blue Jeep right behind you. The driver of the station wagon gave CJ a $5 bill and two quarters. Just give me back two singles, he said. Okay, said C.J. as he handed over the two bills. When there was a break in traffic, C.J. figured out on his clipboard how much money they had. Keep scrubbing, guys, he yelled. One $10 bill equals $10. One $5 bill equals $5. Nine quarters equals $2.25. 12 dimes equals $1.20. 26 nickels is $1.30. And 76 pennies are 76 cents. Add them all up and you get $20.51. We're getting there, CJ yelled out. Cars came all afternoon. Finally, the last car was washed. CJ gave the sluggers back all the money they'd shipped in to buy supplies and counted out what was left. Three $10 bills equals $30. Five $5 bills equals $25. Six $1 bills equals $6. Six quarter equals $1.50. One dime is 10 cents. Nine nickels equals 45 cents. Seven pennies equals 7 cents. And you add them all up and you get $63.12. Wow, he said. When our parents double that amount, we'll definitely have enough money for new t-shirts. We did great. The team had $63.12. The parents chipped in an equal amount, $63.12. Add them up and you get $126.24. Oh, we did, did we, said Will? I guess so, said Lily. Most of us worked really hard, and most of us are really hot and really tired, and really wet, but I notice one of us isn't. Well, I know how to fix that, said Julia. Thank you for listening to my story called Slugger's Car Wash. I hope you enjoyed it and that you learned a lot about adding up dollars and cents. That's a really important skill. In the Math Start series, there are 62 other books that teach important math skills. I think you might enjoy those too. Thank you.